While the inauguration of Joe Biden introduced the new president to the White House, it also introduced the world to Vice President Kamala Harris's stepdaughter, Ella Emhoff. Although social media users were certainly happy to see President Donald Trump leave and Joe Biden take his place, it seems many were more focused on Ella. The unusual 22-year-old is Kamala Harris's daughter by marriage, and she certainly seems to be quite the interesting person. Though her appearance at the inauguration certainly turned heads, people were more impressed when they decided to look up the young artist on social media. The attention has resulted in Ella getting an official job as a fashion model with IGM Models. Join Trender as we look at why Kamala Harris's stepdaughter, Ella Emhoff, is turning heads. Although Joe Biden's inauguration was the first socially distanced inauguration, it didn't stop some of its attendants from exercising their fashion skills. And one person who stood out among the faces of politicians and family members was Ella Emhoff, stepdaughter of the new vice president, Kamala Harris. Ella was wearing a burgundy Batsheva dress underneath a Miu Miu coat that was encrusted with vibrant yet subtle crystals. This outfit in and of itself made the young woman stand out from the crowd, but it was perhaps her facial expressions that truly caught the attention of the audience. When the camera was on her, Ella made a strange little eyebrow wag that seems to have captivated the audience to no end. The young fashionista immediately began trending on social media, drawing a good deal of attention away from both her stepmother and the new president. Hey, Kamala Harris gained her striking stepdaughter when she married her father, Doug Emhoff, in 2015. Since then, the two have had quite the relationship. Ella is very interested in both fashion and art, and these are passions that both Kamala and her husband have encouraged in the young woman. Although Ella certainly made her biggest impression yet with her Batsheva dress and Miu Miu coat, the young lady isn't one to be pinned down by any particular look. On the contrary, she prides herself on her fashion versatility. Just prior to the inauguration, she could be seen in a full Tom Brown suit at a memorial event commemorating lives lost from COVID-19. At this event, her look was designed by the duo of Jill and Jordan. Ella had a connection to these designers through her birth mother, Kirsten Emhoff, who's a bit of a fashionista herself. Ella Emhoff didn't turn into a superstar fashionista overnight, despite how it may appear. She likely has her unique educational background to thank a good deal for her provocative fashion sense. She currently attends the Parsons School of Design in New York City as a senior textile student, specializing specifically in knitting and knitwear. She's used some of this experience to open up and start operating her own knitwear business online. While many of the pieces she creates are varied, they share a common theme of big, bright colors. Although Ella's passion is certainly fashion, she also has an awareness of politics. However, this awareness is more cursory than as a result of a specific drive on her own. According to her, she grew up exposed to politics from an early age. Her household was always filled with strong political opinions, but Ella always cared more for her art. As a child, she was particularly fond of the animated program The Simpsons, which has always been sure to skew both political sides equally. Emhoff has also expressed that the strong politics of her family made it difficult to invite friends over to dinner without her parents lecturing them about whatever random political issue came up. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to Trender if you want to be among the first to know when more awesome videos are coming your way. Although Ella Amhoff's inauguration outfit was curated by the young artist, it was designed by someone else. That designer was Batsheva Hay. According to Batsheva, Ella gave her a very specific reference outfit she had found online. Ella said the vibe she wanted to give off with her outfit was that of a, quote, little girl. The end result, with its scalloped collars and silhouetted shoulders, made the young woman appear slightly like a modernized version of an American girl doll. One can assume that, although the outfit was certainly fitting for the occasion, the strange young woman was likely being at least a little bit tongue-in-cheek. However, it's also possible she just wanted to wear something a bit more feminine after wearing that full Tom Brown suit just a day before. After making waves during the inauguration, Ella found herself becoming quite the celebrity. Her Instagram account received a great deal of attention, with many curious to see what kind of endeavors the young artist filled her day with. What they found were many, many posts showcasing her intricate and rainbow-colored knitwear. And there were plenty of selfies that featured the same tongue-in-cheek vibe that Ella brought to the inauguration with her subtle facial movements. Soon after her social media blew up, it appears Ella was offered a lucrative contract with IMG Models. This is an incredibly prestigious agency that works with some of the top models in the industry. Ella will be joining the ranks of international superstars like Carly Kloss and Gigi Hadid, all thanks to a viral facial twitch.
Well, that and her fashion sense. Ella seems to be incredibly grateful for the opportunity. The young woman has tried her hand at modeling multiple times, and this appears to be her big break. She's also shared that she wasn't always the confident fashionista she appears to be now. According to her, like a lot of young girls out there, she had self-confidence issues growing up. She has shared that growing up it was intimidating and scary to go out into the world that was hyper-focused on her and her body. She then went on to share, somewhat cheekily, that her way of fighting back against the fashion status quo was to be someone who had really weird tattoos and a funky haircut. Although Ella certainly appears to have confidence in her abilities, it also seems she's someone who doesn't need to take herself too seriously. In the fashion world, this seems like a bit of fresh air. Kamala Harris is certainly proud to be the stepmother of such a striking young person. Harris came into her marriage with Ella's father without any children of her own. She was grateful to add Ella and her brother Cole into her family. Kamala married their father, Doug Emhoff, in 2015. According to Kamala, the two kids call her Mamala, while they simply call their father Doug. She shared in the past that she feels her two stepchildren are brilliant, talented, funny kids who have grown to be remarkable adults. Although she was already hooked on Doug, she believes it was Cole and Ella who reeled her in. When Kamala entered into their lives, she also entered into an unlikely friendship with their birth mother. She has shared that the two of them both attend the kids' events, having acted as a duo of cheerleaders in the bleachers at Ella's swim meets and basketball games. Although she went on to say that the doubled attention likely made Ella a little embarrassed. When it comes to her strange fashion choices, Ella says it's something her elders don't understand, but accept because they want her to be who she wants to be. Ella Emhoff certainly isn't the first White House relative to turn heads. Comment down below to share your favorite family member of an elected official from the past, or if you think there needs to be more interesting fashion going on in the White House. And be sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.